guys welcome back to my channel Nando's world and today i'm going to do my first canvas painting or my first painting in my youtube channel it's a canvas painting and so i am using a sharp brush to create that tiny edges if you don't have a flat brush just take ordinary brush and take it gently and turn it very sharp it's something or your bare hands like your bare hands or something okay now we will i'll color it all white and now i'll add a little black there you'll get a gray a dark gray and now you should smooth it out with your fingers that black part and now take a flat brush again and let's make the this part i don't know what it's called i'm very sick of that okay just to remind you use it very slowly very very slowly okay with a brush i'm i'm also very afraid about this because when i started to try one of these is canvas paintings i do it super fast and i got a little carried away i got some steps wrong but it's okay if you get it wrong no problem because you know art is like that learning and to that okay and then if you finish this uh, and even if it doesn't look good uh, you post it that at whatever you do you just take that and post it uh, to us and then we'll check it it's if it even is bad looking it's okay that's what drawing is you'll just keep on trying okay and now i'll use a flat brush to add those Br and this is a wooden uh, wooden house and so i'll add those wood parts those logs and now i'll use that one roof is there on the top i'll add that okay finished and now i'll color it with dark brown and also this picture is there in the link down below so check that out and even you don't need to copy me just look at that picture and draw even that's more fun than this okay hey, remember you got to take it very slowly with this with steps even if it takes a long time you got lots of time and only you don't want to mess up but even if you do no problem that's how you do okay now i'm going to draw one line with the sharp brush and now i'm going to take a flat brush i used a flat brush you see that flat brush i using now i'll take that tree shape the forest tree shape okay you see it's taking the correct shape right you see right okay now we will move on that's good very good and now okay to get that correct shape okay guys you, even you can do this or you will check on google any picture and then you can just do that okay guys and always remember take this very slowly and don't quickly shade it you just use a flat brush i mean i mean use a sharp brush to do the yeah just like it's a drawing Just think it was a drawing instead of painting. Okay, now I'll draw a line to that roof. Yeah. Okay. Now I'll draw some line. Okay, I mean a standing line and go those great lines. I might draw it too big, too small. I'll make it bigger. Sorry, I'm drawing too big, too small. My mistake. Sorry. And it's ending to that roof. And now I'll take. A, fla a fan brush and create that tree texture this is going to be a forest in the background this is remember it's a snow day and that's why it's made of wood i think it's sandas house yeah it's not just sandas house it's just a house people living in the snow that's all made of wood instead of bricks and concrete that's all made of not made of concrete i mean just stacking woods i don't know how they stick the woods together maybe forest leaves sticking i don't know so we'll take a i mean 
sharp brush to create that icy texture this is not icy this is a edge of the ending of the snow you see this is the ending of the snow and i'll make it go there and remember guys it got to be very slow you got to make it very slow very slow and don't forget that even if it looks bad no problem just post it to our and then subscribe and hit the bell button don't forget and thumbs up like okay now i got to carry it away i made the eyes with the dark blue and light blue mixing and now i got to carry it away because i draw the sky without even telling you guys so i draw it with dark blue and create a aurora borealis with uh purple light purple and it didn't come out exactly the aurora borealis as my plan but i draw some stars to make it a little in the next time when we do a aurora borealis i'll make it sure i'll do it correctly and subscribe and like this video and see you in the next video guys